family welcome or welcome back to the channel in 2016 i was diagnosed with traction alopecia and alopecia areata and those were my hair before and this is my hair now after using only diy ingredients to grow my kids and myself hair out for today's recipe we will be using only one infective ingredient and we will need two cups of boiling water for that Our one and only powerful ingredient today is our 100% coffee. Coffee stimulates the hair roots by improving its structure and growth. The caffeine within the coffee restore hair growth and prevent hair loss. The main benefit of the coffee and the caffeine within the coffee is that it helps promote hair growth straight from the roots of the hair, which is in the initial phase of hair growth. It does this through targeting a hormone called DHT. DHT is a hormone that is the cause of all of our hair problems. Caffeine is also known to help to increase blood circulation to the scalp, which promote healthy hair follicles. I will be using three tablespoons of our 100% coffee powder. Now, both males and females can suffer from DHT, so this treatment can be used on both male and females. Our water is hot now, so we are just going to add it into our coffee powder. And then we'll give this a good stir, and I will leave this overnight because it's a little bit late here now and I will start to apply the treatment tomorrow. If you don't have enough time, you can just leave this to steep for anywhere between two to three hours and it will be ready to use. I just pre pro shampoo and deep condition my hair. Our treatment is already infusing overnight but it is very late here now so i'm gonna do the treatment in the morning being that the coffee is very strong and make your hair very very strong we only going to be concentrating it mainly on our scalp to block dht to re reduce shedding and breakage i don't want to leave my hair just like this so the only thing i'm going to be applying to my hair right now it's my S Secret Scoop Board. I'm just going to put a little bit on my hand and just, just massage it into my hair so that tomorrow morning when I take my hair down, it is not completely dry. And then in the morning, we'll just concentrate the treatment on our scalp. Concentrating the treatment on our scalp, that is what going to reduce our shedding, our breakage, and also block DHT. Once your hair is not breaking and though you're not having excessive shedding your hair will continue to grow so this is exactly what i'm gonna do very very easy process and it's late i want to go and watch a movie with my kids so i'm just gonna show you what i'm doing just take a little bit of oil and then just massage it into my hair And after I would just twist this section up, move to the next section, and then I will repeat the same all over my hair, and then we'll continue tomorrow. Now, if you started your treatment early, you don't have to wait until the next day. You can just proceed and just start applying the treatment on your scalp. But being that I started my treatment late and then I also was on the phone with my sister discussing some stuff with the business. So because of that, I've run out of time. I need to go and watch a movie with the kids. So I will continue my treatment tomorrow. The next day, the next morning, I got my stocking. 
so that we can screen our mixture. And then I also got my little sifter. I'm just going to put that over it. Easy application on our scab and our hair. I'm just going to transfer it into my spray bottle. Very simple but effective treatment is ready. So let's just go and start applying it on our hair and our scab. To use this treatment, there are a few rules applied to it. Number one, make sure you are wearing something dark. Also, whatever you are using to put around your neck, if it's tower or something to protect your shoulder, make sure that it is also very dark because we are using coffee. Coffee can stain things. I tried using coffee before to cut out my gray hair. It did not work for me. But if you have color treated hair or if your hair is gray, then I would recommend that you do a patch test first before applying it all over your hair. Because I know many people love their gray hair. They don't want to change the color of it. Most especially of our elders, people who have on the channel that follow us, you guys admire your gray hair. So just try to do a little bit of patch test before. But I tried using it on my gray. It did not work. It did not cut on my gray hair. I still left with my gray hair. Now we got our treatment. I've taken those out of the way. Let's just start applying it to our hair. I'm going to focus it mainly on my scalp because as you guys know, our hair grows from our scalp. I'm just going to moisturize my hair a little bit just so it can be easy. From you know, party in smaller sections because we don't want no breakage, so we cannot work on completely dry hair. I forgot to put my towel on. Let me just put that around me quick. I'm wearing a dark shirt, I really don't mind, but I just don't love it dripping on me a lot. Now I need something to hold. I cannot find my snore hair tie. I think Aurora took it away, so just ignore this. Then I'm just going to start parting my hair in very small sections to be able to focus. Oops! <laughs> focus it on my scalp. Then massaging in a little bit. We'll do a thorough massage after that. I'm also just going to spray some down my hair shaft. Work that in. Get the ends. 
at the ends our oils part of our hair so it is always already weak so we have to keep on protecting it and after I'm just going to twist this section up and apply the treatment to the rest of my hair using the same method yes my hair is growing I'm thinking to do a blow dry using the ref air after I rinse this treatment out. But well, let's see if I'm not not too tired. I will go ahead and just blow dry my hair also. Okay, so I'm just going to apply the treatment on the rest of my hair. I'm going to apply the treatment to my entire hair and scalp. I have very little left, so if your hair is as thick as mine or long as mine. This is how much that I use. One thing I would suggest is that when you're applying this treatment to your hair, better you do it outside so that you don't have to clean up a lot because I have a lot of spurs all around that I need to clean up. After applying the treatment on my hair, I'm just going to cover my hair up with my shower cap and then I will leave the treatment on for 45 minutes. You can leave it on for 30 minutes. Let the heat from the shower cap just marinate the treatment into our hair follicles and then after that I will just go and rinse it out and moisturize my hair and then you can style your hair how you want to do it but just make sure that you moisturize it because at the end your hair will feel very very strong so you need to make sure either you do the LCO method or you do the LOC method whichever way that works best for you but I'm thinking of coming to blow dry my hair after I rinse it out, I don't know, I'm still thinking about that yet. But it's a very, very effective treatment. I have a lot of videos on my channel about coffee. It's not my first time using coffee. I've been using coffee for a very long time. I also have my caffeine group or which have coffee in it to also block THC. I also did our handmade coffee group or I will leave those videos down below all the videos that I've been using coffee in so it's not my first time I know it's effective I know it will work so if you love this video do not forget to give me a like leave a comment down below and subscribe and I will see you in my next video bye bye